Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm doing another first impressions. I've got this Newton's Labs T-Zone Skincare Charcoal Nose Pore Strips. So I've used this type before, but not the charcoal ones. And I saw these and they were quite really affordable. So I really wanted to try it out and see how it works. Because I always used to be your nose strips, like the charcoal ones. And they are so expensive. Like the Bior ones, normal price are like £9 or something. And this is actually just like £1.50. So I actually want to give it a shot because there isn't that many charcoal nose strips out there. And Bior is really the only main ones. So I thought I'd give this a try and see how it goes. Let's see what the instruction says. Thoroughly wet your nose, peel the strip off the backing and apply the smooth side to your nose. Gently press down to ensure good contact with the skin and leave the strip to dry for 5 to 10 minutes. As soon as the strip begins to feel stiff, it is ready to remove. Starting at the edges, slowly and carefully remove the strip. If the strip is painful to remove, wet the strip thoroughly and carefully peel it off. And it says it's formulated to draw out dirt and excess oil help remove impurities, unclog pores, and be specifically shaped for use over the bridge of your nose. So right here I've got some hot water, it was not hot, it's like warm water to kind of open up my pores and so I can wet my nose. I've got a towel as well, so let's get into it. Okay, so now I'm going to start wetting my nose and opening my pores with my hot water. So I'm just going to open the pore strip. So I just took it out of the box and this is what it looks like. It's a little thing like it usually comes in. It just comes with like the usual plastic bit at the back and then that's just a strip there then you just place it on your nose like that when also you remove this bit plastic bit first place it on your nose and that's that okay so i think my pores are definitely open my nose is so red oh my god so now i'm just gonna take this off and put it on my nose oh, this is what my nose looks like beforehand so close up for my ming and pores and everything I always have issues with nose strips like around this bit, like it never really sticks into that grooves, which is really annoying. And I feel like this nose strip is actually maybe too small because it's not really sticking to my nose very well because I do have quite a large nose. Next time I would probably cut it like here and like up here just so that it can fit around my nose properly. So I'm just gonna wait for like the five, 10 minutes. So like obviously it can dry and then I can peel it off and show you. It says Newton's Labs T-Zone Skincare Charcoal Nose Pore Strips are enriched with naturally purifying tea tree to help keep skin clear with charcoal while charcoal acts like a magnet to draw out impur impurities and excess oil. So I think this is gonna work really well to be honest. So I'm hoping once this one dries properly that it can live up to what I'm actually expecting from like a nose strip because no, a lot of nose strips nowadays don't actually do what they're supposed to do. Like they don't take off as many blackheads like as I would expect them to which is really annoying because I do have a really lot of embedded blackheads on my nose and a lot of things that I purchased like I wanted to remove my blackheads. Fingers crossed this works. So far it's all good. It was a bit of like a challenge to get it on everything but it's on now so um, I'll come back when it's dry and then we can peel it off together. I just wanted to come in and say that you can definitely um, smell the tea tree oil I can smell it coming off which is really good and I can feel it being a little bit like minty in a way like you know that kind of like tingly kind of feeling it's nothing too major it's quite soothing and relaxing actually so I just thought, thought I would come in and say that as a part of the first impressions kind of like what I'm expecting and what's actually happening so that's happening 
and I do feel like it's creasing quite a lot it's like a lot of bubbling so it's not actually gonna stick into that part and I think that's probably the reason like because it's so small as well so next time I should probably cut it but so far so good okay so that's me back I've been away for quite a while now um, it says to leave it on for like 5 to 10 minutes and I think I probably left it on for like 15 to 20 minutes so I wanted to make sure it was like proper rock solid and it is pretty hard so I'm going to try and remove it now okay it's a little bit sore but nothing major like the Bjorn nose strips are way more sore than this one is so oh god this side is oh my god this side is so sore <laughs> There better be something out of this nose, I tell you. After all this pain. Uh, there's literally like nothing even on this nose strip at all whatsoever. But there's nothing even like being removed, which I'm quite disappointed at to be honest. This is what my nose looks like, honestly. It looks basically the exact same as it did before. This is such a disappointment. It's on so overall, I'm quite disappointed to be honest. I actually thought this was gonna work really well. Like my expectations are so high for a lot of things, especially no strips. Like I did to take a few big ones out. But I didn't take as much as I would have hoped. I think maybe it might be because that some parts of the actual nose strip never really touched my nose properly. But my nose is really soft. And I know that a makeup application on top of it is going to be really nice, which is good. But yeah, to be honest, I'm, I'm not really expecting much because it is like a £1.50 nose strip and you get six in the packet. And compared to the Bior strips, like they're usually like nine pound, so I would expect them to work because they're so expensive. But since these ones are so cheap, like I'm not really expect, I didn't, shouldn't I be really expecting too much? And it did take a few, but nothing too major. Like maybe if you're a beginner in no strips and you don't want to go for the really expensive ones like try the cheaper ones first because they are quite sore to take off and if you have a low pain tolerance i probably wouldn't recommend them at all and i know there are a lot of different methods to remove blackheads like i'm still trying to figure out ways i can actually remove my blackheads because no strips doesn't seem to really work well for me at all so overall my first impression I'm not very impressed to be honest. I still got a few more to use, so I'll keep using them because they are cheap. And I'll, maybe if I want like a, just like a quick one and I can't afford to get like the more expensive ones, I can just settle for these ones. But honestly, I would recommend just getting the Dior charcoal nose strips because they do work. Sometimes they don't because if you don't apply them in a certain way, you have to make sure your nose is definitely like open like the pores in your nose have to be open or it will not work at all whatsoever so this is the finished video guys i really hope you all enjoyed this first impression please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already you can also follow me on all my social medias on twitter and instagram i'm Valerie stormer and you can like my facebook page which is makeup by Valerie stormer so Thanks again for watching. I'll see you again in the next video. Bye, guys.